morning, as you can tell, is pretty early. Well, I mean, 10 o'clock, is that early? 10 to 30, that's just in early, early at all. So as you guys can see from the title today, we are only gonna be at one place for 24 hours, and that is Costco, only eating Costco sample foods. I'm pretty pumped, you guys. I'm not gonna lie. I haven't had that Costco poutine in such a long time. I'd say like since high school. Costco poutine? Yeah. Do they hand that out as a sample? No, it's in the food court. We're only eating, you know the little white trays they give you with the, like the carrot with like a little piece of dip or something or a chip? Yeah. We're only eating those. You can't buy anything from the food court. But it's Costco food. Samples. We're only eating samples for 24 hours, Jazz Paul. And right now, it's like 10 o'clock in the morning. I don't even think they have samples available. We might not be able to eat breakfast today. That's all I'm saying. Well, this video just took a terrible turn. Well, it's not terrible. What do you mean? It's going to be fun. Oh, my God. Jazz Paul, it's okay. Come here. The hot dogs are only 68 cents. I know. You can get this hot dog for free, Jazz Paul. Yeah, but I wanted a big one. I'm tired of having small hot dogs. The rule for today, for breakfast, lunch, and dinner for the next 24 hours, the only thing we can eat are the things they are giving away. It's not like we can buy the sample. You can only eat the sample. I really think Jazz Ball is going to struggle with this video today because he eats a lot. He I do eat a lot. I'm starting to eat a lot more now, you guys, just because I'm starting to exercise a bit more, but that means that I have to... I have to exercise it! Anyways, I have a high metabolism. It's not my fault that my body burns the fat. That's wow, now you're calling me fat. Oh my god. Dude. Mention your name. Wow! It's not fat. You're warm. Well, you know what? Are you okay? Mm. I'm fine. I just, uh,. Threw up in my mouth a little bit. It's gonna be really awkward. Oh my god, I know. They're gonna think we're homeless. They're gonna think we're literally homeless people going in three times a day just to get samples. It's kinda hard to be homeless when you have a... Hold on. A Costco card! That's right, I'm a homeless person. Anybody can go in and buy a Costco card. What do you mean? A homeless person can't have a Costco card? No. Why not? Because... I have a star in my... So yeah, if you guys are excited and you would want to do this yourself, be sure to kick that like button down below. Let's see if we get how many Costco's known for things in bulk. So we need a bulk-sized amount of likes, which is 30 trillion. 30 trillion. 30 trillion zillion. Bitches. Wow. Number yet? Well, there's not even 30 trillion people in the world, so we can't. Yeah, there get are. If you are new, be sure to subscribe and turn on your post notifications because that is the most important thing you can do for these videos so you see every time we upload one of these stupid challenges. Mom, why are you calling me? Let's head into Costco right now and grab breakfast. Hopefully they have stuff because... I like peanuts. Hopefully they have some peanuts there. Alright guys, so as you can see, we are now in Costco. Jazz Paul is... I don't know what he's doing. Don't tell me right now. Well, they can't even tell that you're on, on. A, you're on a, your, your pants are on. Dude, there's a hole in my pants. <laughs> But there's one problem going on right now, guys. We're here right now, but they don't start serving samples till we don't know when. There's literally nothing for us to 11 eat. 11.30. 11.30. So why did you tell us to come here at 10.45? We're gonna stick it out for the next maybe 10, 15 minutes and see. Otherwise, we're not gonna be able to eat breakfast because there's not gonna be any samples and that's all we can eat for this entire day. All right, Jasper. As you guys can see, this is the 1,000 limit. That one has a 500 limit. Meaning that the expression from the expression of this toilet is a little bit more different. More back support, a little bit more rounded area, a little bit of a tilt, so when you just glide right in. Whereas that one had a little more pressure to the water. But what do you want to have? Pressure or have the smoothness of the quality of this fiber toilet? How much is this toilet? <sighs> it's hard to say. <laughs> All right, so um, it's been 20 minutes. No samples yet. They are just starting to prepare them. But if this is truly gonna be breakfast, we can't wait around till 12 o'clock. So breakfast is done. No breakfast for us. There are no. What? Spoons. <laughs> I've always wanted to have a plate to serve people. Jazz pull, Butterfingers! But we're here, we're at Costco, so we might as well make the most of it. So let's just explore for a bit and then we'll head home. So 
that was a mega fail. We're doing a 24 hour only eating challenge and they had no samples out. As we were walking out, they started to set some of them up. But the thing is, it's not breakfast anymore. Breakfast ends at 11 o'clock. Everybody knows that. Breakfast ends when McDonald's tells you, you can't get a McGriddle anymore. I've had that many times happen to me and it, it's, um, it's just that ridiculous. So, um, uh, we're, are you hungry? Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> this isn't a huge deal for me because I usually only drink coffee for breakfast. I can't have coffee today, but I never really eat anything, even though breakfast is the important, most important meal. But to me, this isn't a big deal. I don't mind not eating breakfast. I won't, I won't die. Now, I'm the complete opposite, though, because I need to have breakfast. Breakfast is my, probably my favorite meal of the whole day. And right now, I am dying because I need to eat something. Well, I mean, I did I did buy something, though, from Costco. You can't go to Costco and not buy anything. What'd you get? Um... I got um. Oh my god, Derek! Are you kidding me? <laughs> Chicago mix. Yeah. Are you? That's you said, our favorite popcorn. You said you were hungry. Derek. And I mean, can't I can't. I can't eat it. I know I can't. Derek, you can't have that. I can't have any because of the. Oh, look at that cheesy. Oh! Side. Oh! Just, just take a little sniff, Jaspol. Jaspol. Oh, no, 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 no! What are you? Stop! No! You can have a little bit. Just have some. Oh my God, Derek! It's I'm breakfast. So hungry. You need breakfast, Jazzball. How are you gonna become the famous soccer star that you wanna be if you don't have breakfast inside of you? That makes no sense at all. But I don't really care because I need to eat something right now, Derek. Oh, just you know you want to. Oh ah, God, no! Just have one the more. The caramel. No, I can't, Derek. I can't. Look how good. Oh my God, the caramelly, chocolatey. Oh, there's no chocolate. I mean, the caramelly, cheesy. It just smells like heaven in there. I'm gonna be honest. Right, I'm gonna go throw this in the garbage. Yeah, you can't throw it away. Right. You can't throw it. We can't eat it today. I'm you throwing can it out. Save it for another day. Jazz ball, I'm throwing it in the garbage. Yeah, you can save it for Unless another somebody day. eats it right now, this is going in the garbage. Yeah, you don't need I'm going to this go. <laughs> Let go, Jazz ball. <laughs> I'm throwing it in the garbage. I'm gonna get out. I'm gonna I want to go back to Costco. It's like throwing a child in the garbage. That's illegal. You know what? Stop. Thanks to you, an entire bag of $9 popcorn was wasted. You're a disgusting human being. We're heading home until lunch, which is gonna be in like two hours, so hopefully we can survive. Oh my god. Breakfast has been <laughs> Breakfast has been completed and honestly guys, I am not doing too bad considering the fact that we didn't eat breakfast. One, I don't really eat breakfast and I kind of prepared just a little bit for this video last night. Because I know that we're not going to be able to eat a lot of food, I decided to, you know, make my dinner just a little bit bigger than it would normally be. And just have, like, you know, like, one extra little serving after dinner before bed so that my stomach was full and prepared for today. So I'm not doing too bad considering we didn't get to eat any breakfast. Unfortunately, I thought this video might have been over quickly. Jazz Paul loves Chicago mixed popcorn. He can eat that entire big ass bag by himself probably. So maybe after lunch, if he's still alive because Jazz Paul eats so much, I will try another tactic. We're gonna head over and grab lunch pretty soon this time because we didn't get to eat anything for breakfast and we know Costco samples should be up around 12 or one o'clock. So we're gonna head over there pretty soon and grab our lunch. Hopefully they have samples, maybe Costco Costco just stop serving samples and that that would suck because then this video would just be us literally starving to death And I don't think 24 hours starving to death challenge would do uh, would really do really well on YouTube. So you know, <laughs> Please Costco have samples. I want to eat something today besides Jasper's dinner. Right now I am absolutely starving. We didn't have any breakfast as you guys already know I cannot have nothing for breakfast. It's impossible for me So I need to be eating something in order for me to keep moving on to the rest of the day Otherwise, I'm gonna be passing out very soon And I can't do that considering last time I passed out and that wasn't good. Remember the Starbucks video? You guys remember that? Yeah, that was not a good thing Okay, I lost that challenge and I'm not gonna lose this one either <laughs> In all seriousness, you guys, I definitely need to eat something or have some kind of smell or something to food. So my body knows that food will be coming because I'm sure those Costco samples will be there when the second time we go out. I got a bagel, I'm gonna start smelling that. Hopefully that'll help me out a little bit more. Oh. Alright guys, so I usually love having peanut butter, but unfortunately I can't have it right now, so I have to smell it, and hopefully that does give me the oh. I know I'm gonna be able to eat later on, and this should get me through the next, I guess, couple hours until we go back to Costco and have lunch. So it's been a couple hours, we are back at Costco. They have the samples ready for us. We're gonna eat some freaking lunch now. Guys, let us know if you could have any sample of anything, what would it be and why? Okay, let's go find the samples and let's see what they have, okay? If you could have one sample of anything, what would it be? <laughs> I would have a sample of Rosanna Pansino's cooking because I, I would give any, I would trade in Jazz Paul for a little bit of a taste. Nice. 
I hope it's honest. Apple cinnamon, a uh, little toasty Mc toaster. Mm. Imagine having an entire one instead of just a little piece. Let's go find the next thing. Oh, you're gonna eat all of it without me? <gasps> Dang! I'm gonna have to go get my own. That's the whole point. I'm trying to win the challenge, Unless okay? Unless we kiss right now. How was it? I had two, so it was amazing. Well, I had one. It was good. And I want another one. <laughs> Well, how is it then? No, dude, it's three french fries, okay? <laughs> Probably not gonna be that great. Is it okay? It's only really good because I'm literally starving to death. I got a burnt one. Here. I know. Do you think anybody's actually ever bought the food based on eating the sample? Because that's never happened to me. And this one looks freaking. Like, it does look like a gourmet meal. He does not know how to cook pasta. Okay, you're underdone. terrible. He was so eating. underdone. <laughs> I'm sorry, I'm, I'm a critic. <laughs> I asked the lady if she can give us a sample, and she literally says, well, if you're here to buy and not just a snack. So I think the employees are talking. <laughs> yeah, they know, exactly. Um, but this is like mustardy, pretzel-y, nutty, nut nuts. Tastes like honey mustard. This is a nice little dessert snack. Yeah, this wasn't too bad, honestly. If you look at the coloring, it looks pretty decent, you know? The coloring? Yeah, it really brings a lot of flavor to it. I got some oh! Gosh, I am starving! We're back now from the lunch portion of the video, and one, I am so freaking, I don't know how that meal I ate last night is gone. I should not have taken a dump. Why did I poop today? I should have held it all in and absorbed the nutrients from the poop. Jazz Paul is not doing well, guys. I know, he, I'm not doing well, but he's doing worse. We had about five samples, I think, total for lunch, and we did not eat breakfast. We are both starving. So what I'm gonna do right now is I think I might be able to tempt him and make him lose before dinner, because we both complete dinner if we both go to Costco one more time and eat samples that is 24 hours of only eating samples and we both tie I'm not down for a tie guys I do not tie unless it's the one around my neck when I'm going out in the town trying to pick up some cuties <sighs> number 604255 the popcorn was close, but it did not work. What I'm gonna do right now is try Jazz Paul's favorite food. Jazz Paul, more than anything, loves pizza. A lot of you guys love pizza too. Leave in the comment section down below. What is your favorite kind of pizza? So, Jazz Paul's favorite food is pizza, but not only pizza, but pizza from Pizza Hut. So what I'm gonna do right now is I'm going to, on my computer right now, I'm on the Pizza Hut website. I have it up. I don't wanna show you guys any addresses or anything, so I'm just gonna tell you what I am doing. I'm going to order the cheesiest large pizza Jazz Paul has ever seen to his door at his house and hopefully he will eat it. How is he gonna refuse a large cheese pizza to himself? Nobody else is home. He gets the entire thing to himself and he's starving. So we're gonna go over here. Create your own pizza. Large, definitely. You can do a five cheese stuffed crust. Definitely doing that. Five cheese stuffed crust. Four dollars more? Who cares? Extra cheese with a five cheese stuffed crust. How do you reject that? You cannot reject that. So we have a large pizza with a five cheese stuffed crust, regular tomato sauce, extra cheese. So let's add that to Order. I hope I can pay for it on the site because if this shows up to Jazz Paul's house I don't think he's gonna want to pay for it. He's gonna tell the pizza guy that he didn't order a pizza When would you like it now? We want it now. It's my money and I need it now It's my money and I need it now Shut the f*** up! Here it says delivery driver instructions. What I'm gonna write in if man tries to reject Pizza, dot, 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 it's a joke. Hopefully, that will cause the guy to know, like, oh, this guy's just kidding, and he will force Jazz Ball to take it. So I can pay right now, which is perfect. Let me type in my payment information here. Hopefully, I wrote Jazz Ball's address incorrectly, and there's gonna be a large, the cheesiest pizza he's ever seen arriving. Your order confirmation number is 1352. Okay, it's coming. Pizza is on the way right now to Jazz Ball's house. Guys, please kick that like button if you haven't done that yet. Hopefully, he takes this, and it works. All right, you guys, so a uh, quick update, a pizza was just delivered for me from Pizza Hut. You might be wondering, who sent you a pizza, Jasper? This is really random. Well, I think I have the answer for you guys. I asked the person who delivered the pizza who actually sent this pizza to me, and all he said was, they left a note saying, at Jasper95. Now, there's only one person in the entire world that loves that name more than I do, and that's Derek. So obviously, Derek sent me a pizza from my favorite pizza place to get me pissed off and try to eat the pizza to make me lose this challenge. Do you know what, Derek? I'm not gonna do that. Look at the pizza he made. Oh my god! Are you kidding me? That is double stuffed. That is, that is, oh my god, the crust is stuffed on this one. I know it is. I have to try it, I have to try it. Can't believe he would do this. <sighs> oh, I want this pizza so bad! Oh no! I can't! I'm sorry, I can't! I can't do it, I can't do it. You know what, Derek, you can't believe you did this to me. You know pizza has my favorite pizza and you made me just throw it away like that. To push it aside where I can't have it. Why would you do something like that? It's terrible! You know what, I'm gonna FaceTime right now. I'm gonna get to the bottom of this right away. 
Yo, what are you doing? I can't even see anything. What are you talking about? Why did you send me a pizza from Pizza Hut? I didn't send you a pizza, Jasmine. What are you talking about? Yes, you did, dude. I'm taking a dump right now at my cousin's house. You think I have time to send you a pizza? Okay, I have to be quiet. I don't want them to hear me. What do you want? Derek, I swear to God, dude. You definitely sent me a pizza right now. I asked the, someone to send me a pizza. Look, someone literally just sent me. I think it'd be so cool if you took a bite right now. I want that so bad. Take a bite for me, buddy. Come on. Yeah, sure, Derek. No, how about no? And I asked the person who sent the pizza, and they're like, oh, all the notes said was at Jazzy95. I wonder who sent that then, huh, Derek? He told you that? Yes, he did! Oh, I'm not saying that! Wow, you douchebag! Why would you say something like that then? Why would you do this? Okay. You've never done that before. Now you only do it when you have a challenge. What the hell? Well, you know what, Jasper? I'm gonna send you five more beautiful ones. Okay? You're gonna wish you didn't. No. This is the kind of BS that I have to put up with when it comes to dare. When it comes to challenges. Why can't you just play fair, huh? It's already hard enough for me. We were having a good time. Costco was having some pretty good portions of food right now. So why the fuck does he guys? Why? Why does he keep doing this kind of shit? It's not fair. You've turned down pizza. That's my favorite. Pizza of all time. He's really crossed the line this time, and I'm really pissed. I honestly don't know if the pizza worked. Jazz Paul FaceTime, you guys will know if the pizza worked. I won't know until I meet up with him, but for now, we are about to head out for our last meal dinner for our samples of Costco foods. And when we went there for lunch, the last person we asked for a sample, when I asked them, hey, may we have a sample of this, she said, Yeah, if you guys are here to buy stuff and not just eat. Bitch, what? Who, what do you call it? What? Usually Costco employees are very nice, but she was not. And what I thought is maybe they are on to us and maybe they know that we are just having samples and not actually buying anything. So I told Jasper that when we go in for dinner, we should both be in completely new outfits so that nobody recognizes us. I'm gonna change my shirt, my pants, my shoes, my everything to make sure that no employee sees us and that we don't get kicked out for literally only going to Costco to eat samples for 24 hours. I'm also feeling very lightheaded right now. I think that's because I literally haven't eaten anything thing today besides a couple freaking little pieces of, of English muffin, some yam fries, and a freaking raisin bun. That's not enough food for a growing boy. So I'm going to head over to Jazz Ball's house. We're going to pick him up and do the last round for this 24 hour only eating samples. And hopefully Jazz Ball is caved by now because I have a massive headache. My body feels very weak because we have had next to nothing. So I'm excited to eat these samples. But if we both eat the samples and finish the challenge, I don't know what's going to freaking happen. So let's go grab him. Here he comes, the man, the myth. <sighs> The guy, guy was wearing the exact same. I told you to change so they didn't know we were going again, Jazz Paul. I did change. Ring is on this finger, not this finger anymore. And I'm wearing a bracelet this time. And also my shoes I'm wearing white Air Jordans now. Last time I was wearing white. You think they care about what shoes you were wearing? They were, you were wearing a white and gray. No, you have to go change your clothes. Change, you don't change that. Make it yourself look different. Like, if I change too much, they're gonna be suspicious. They're not gonna remember your face. Change now. I change everything. I change my underwear. Oh. So needy. Thank you. <laughs> what are you doing? I don't understand what's your problem now. You're wearing the same clothes. I'm wearing sunglasses. Oh my God, they won't expect a thing. As well, why would you wear sunglasses inside of a fucking Costco? In case they have retina scanning. With my sunglasses on, they can't do that. You're so stupid, Derek. God. Yeah, Go change your clothes! Thank you. You're wearing black. Great. Incognito. You took off the glasses. That's awesome. Thank you, Jazz Paul. We are about to head over to the very last meal for this Costco samples. And let me just say, I am very excited to eat because I am starving. We've eaten like four little bites of food today. Well, I only ate the four little things. Jazz Paul, on the other hand, for some reason, ordered a pizza. Okay? And that's not a part I of the world. I didn't order a pizza. You're the one that ordered it to my house. You ate it, didn't you? I didn't eat it. Obviously, I didn't eat it, all right? My sister was home. She had it. Your sister ate a large pizza to herself? We both know she's not capable of that. Feet. She has friends. They came over. They had it too. Oh, yeah I always forget that like other people have friends besides one like they have multiple So we're heading over to Costco right now This is the last meal for the day Hopefully somebody cracks and buys like a salad or freaking a big large chicken breast and loses because right now All I want is some samples and I'm ready to freaking get them. Me too. No, you don't you want a poutine no. oh. oh, I would love to have a poutine. I'd love to have pizza. I'd love to have the hot dogs They have a poutine at Costco. Oh god, it's shut something up. It's special. It just Shh. melts in your mouth. Shut up, please. Shut shut up. <gasps> What? You can't I, eat my head! I thought they were poutine fries! Is this a sample from Costco? I thought it was poutine! Alright, let's head to Costco and get our dinner. Hopefully they don't kick us out because last time they almost did. We have the first sample as you guys saw before. We changed outfits and everything, but I think they're even more on to us because there was only one sample in the entire store. We're so good. far. 
so far we we did a very nice walk around but we're gonna do it again to see if we can find anything else what we're gonna do for now is taste test whatever the heck this chocolate little ball is chocolate macaroon for vegans very exquisite <laughs> Oh, the texture is not good. That's disgusting. I really hope this isn't the only thing we have. I definitely want to throw up. Right, so we have walked around and we're getting kind of scared because, you want to tell them? Just there's nothing. There's, there's, no, there's nothing. <laughs> there's no more samples, guys. All we, we've had is that vegan piece of shit. We kept the papers because we might have to eat these, but there's literally nothing. We should probably walk around one more time. We're screwed there. The, and the only lady that we saw was the lady from last time that told us, oh, make sure you're buying stuff and not just snacking. She knows. That's going to be our dinner. One little macro. Well, we can try and get more, but I don't think that's going to work. Let's Let's. See, I don't think I can do this. <laughs> Why? I know I'm starving. I'm hungry right too, okay? Let's just see if we can find anything else. Maybe there's something in this lunchbox. You obviously can't eat the backpack. You know why? Because it's roots. And if you eat roots, you're eating Canadians. That means you're being racist. <laughs> Canadians taste good. Tastes like maple syrup and beavers. We've walked on the store three times. The entire store and only that one sample. We've only had it once. So I don't know what we're gonna do. Jasper, you need to stop that. You know what, Derek? Calm down. I'm hungry. I've sniffed enough of this where I know I've gone a bit more crazy now. So the fact of the matter is, I have a plan. I always keep my little baby safe. We will eat tonight. I promise you that. The only thing that is open is that same freaking stand. So I honestly don't know what we're gonna do. Guys, I have it. I have a date in two hours and I can't eat dinner on the date. So I need to fill up my stomach now. If I don't do it now, I'm gonna pass out and fall asleep. You know what? I'll take one for the team. I have a plan. You're gonna give up? No. Please, just eat. No, I have a plan, okay? Don't worry. Remember when you told me to bring all those different kind of outfits? You mean, forced me to change? You mean the sunglasses? Well, yeah. And that's I have all, all you... that stuff with me right now. And I figured if I keep changing my outfit, they'll never recognize it's me. I can get like maybe 15 portions of the exact same thing. I can do it, Derek. I know I can. They're gonna know. What, are you gonna change your what? Put your glasses on? Oh, yeah. Glasses for one time. Ring on this finger, this finger, this finger. One, two, three, four, five, oh six, God. seven, eight. You get eight chances there. Then you have the glasses. And then you have glasses with the ring. 35 chances right there. That's 35 different What are you gonna do with 35 portions, Jasper? Hide gonna, them all? We're gonna feast. What am I supposed to do? Listen, you're gonna stay here. And you're gonna look pretty. So daddy's gonna bring home the bacon. Okay, how long are you gonna be getting all these samples? An hour? 10 minutes, 10 minutes max. I'm gonna wait Wish right here. Wish you better be with 40 of those freaking things. 35. I said 35. You're sorry, much if you ask for 40. Okay, okay. Well, good go. It's been 10 minutes, not it's been 15 minutes now. Okay, guys, at this point, people are looking at me, they don't know what I'm doing. They think I'm just standing here being a freaking idiot. I'm hungry, I'm gonna die pretty soon. This guy clearly wants to help me out somehow, but he's I don't know what to do. I honestly don't know what to do anymore. Should I wait? I mean, he said he's trying to make rations and everything like that, but I don't know if that's true. But the thing about I have to be home, I have like there's things I have to do. Oh no. Guys, that's Jazz Paul. Abort, abort. Mommy caught Big Dad. This is bought a drill. He meant not. But clearly he meant not. Mommy caught Big Dad. This is why we don't use Jazz Paul's camera, because it never freaking focuses Jazz Paul. You know what? I don't have time to type. I'm going to send him a voice message. Daddy, daddy, daddy. Is this a drill? What happened? Hopefully he can hear that. I'm hungry. Okay, I'm alone. There's only so many things a guy can do in Costco by himself. I'm just waiting to see if we're going to get these freaking 45 samples that I was promised. He thinks this is a joke. He thinks my lol got kicked out crying, laughing, and a birthday cake. And afterwards, he decided to throw in an eggplant. You know what? We're not going to get any more food today. There's only one way we can settle this challenge, and that's with what Costco is legendary for. Jazz, clearly, he is in the car waiting for me because he's just on his phone, just jerking off at this point, sending me. He thinks this is a joke. But you know what? It's not going to be a joke. Somebody actually winning this challenge. It's freaking pouring rain. Jazz Paul, what are you doing? Why are you in the car? What happened to the samples? I stood 15 minutes. I waited for you. I went in for the first sample and it was okay second time okay third time they started asking questions fourth time they were like okay what are you doing and i'm like what do you mean i'm having my first sample ever oh my god and they're like no you've been here before i'm like no i haven't i have uh, twins though that i'm related to oh <laughs> that maybe that's maybe you, who you saw twins that you're related to opposed to twins that you aren't related to long story short they <laughs> kicked me out they're saying that you're just using this for having dinner you're not gonna buy the food are you and i'm like uh excuse me i'm a costco gold member they ask me out. <laughs> what happened to the samples that you got? How many did you get? Well, you got four? That's it? Yeah, and they... <laughs> Come away. Oh my god. You're taking this fork first of all. What did you get? You know what? I got something that's gonna end this challenge because I actually when I say I'm gonna do something I do it We got two of them one for you and one for me pull it up to the camera jazz ball open it Oh my god, oh my god Derek. That is a, a Costco, Costco poutine. Don't you dare take a bite of that yet because somebody is about to lose this challenge Okay, we've both been eating samples all day and now we both have a poutine in front of us jazz ball I have a date in an hour and a half. I need food inside of me. Okay, we're both gonna eat these right now together and lose you know what? I have a date too. I think that's fair. Let's do it. 
<laughs> I would never have a date. Okay, you know what? Let's both take a bite. Let's end this video and have a good freaking meal for once, okay? Let's cheers to the Costco poutine. Oh my god, right, this Eric. smells. Costco poutine, vegetarian Wait. grade. You're not gonna eat it, are you? I'm not. You're gonna setting eat. me up like you always do. I don't know if I want to do this. I'm setting you up. Yeah. You're gonna, you're gonna set me up. I know you are. I just want to eat a fresh Costco poutine and end the challenge. I'm not setting you up. I feel like you are. You're gonna do that to me. I'm gonna do what? You're gonna set me up. How am I setting you up for what? I'm not gonna eat it. Yeah, you're gonna say we're gonna eat at the same time. We don't. Oh my God, Jasper, would I do that? There's only one way I'm gonna eat this. What? We eat this. We're looking each other in the eyes. No blinking. At the I'm same not. No. Time. Are you kidding me? That's the only one to do it. Okay, fine. Then I guess we're just gonna wait and see who caves first. Cause I'm not doing that. I'm doing that. Let's do it. I'm not looking at you in the eyes and eating a poutine, Jazz Paul. I'll eat the poutine together with you, but I'm not. Can you stop looking at me, you psychopath? I want you. <laughs> <laughs> no, I'm not looking at you, Jazz Paul. I can't look and eat. No, the poutine's too sexual for me to look at your eyes and eat at the same time. No, we're not. Jazz Paul, it's been an, an uh, entire hour. Is this the only way we're gonna end this challenge? Can you stop? You freaking weirdo! I just want to eat so I can have some energy to go out. Cause I can't eat dinner if I don't do that right now. I can't eat dinner out there. I'm supposed to eat caught. I can't stop. Like you need to stop. Will you eat this with me? I will eat it with you if you look at me in the oh eye. It's the only way I'm gonna do it. No, I can't. I can't do it. If you screw me over right now, you, you'd be a strategist over. like me. No, I would never do that. Once and for all, let's end up equal time. Three, two, one. Oh god. That was probably the gayest thing I've ever done in my life. Oh my god, shut up. I, I can't talk. That was so good. Mm, oh, I needed that. Do you know what I feel bad for? I don't feel bad for you or me. I feel bad for people in America who don't have this at Costco. Oh god. They don't have this in Costco? Not in, they oh my god, Becky! Oh my god, Becky! We died the challenge for the first time! Oh my god, we're such on equal terms, but we get a poutine and we're needing the Costco sample because they weren't there at the time. Oh my god, we f***ing did it! This is worth the end. I haven't had a Costco poutine in so freaking long since I was in like high school. We tied, we both lost. We looked each other in the eyes and we had, I, we, I f All right guys, so today, because there was no sample, there was one sample for dinner, we tied in this challenge. If you guys enjoyed this and you want us to do a video where we just eat Costco foods for 24 hours, but you guys get to decide every single one that we eat, be sure to kick that like button down below and let us know in the comments. Jazz Paul's chowing down right now. He doesn't even know what's going on. We've been eating samples all day. My head hurts from lack of nutrition. Oh, and because nobody lost, none of us have to forfeit, but we're both gonna put a picture on our Instagrams and what you guys need to do is go over and like whichever one you like like more and whoever gets more likes in the next challenge will have to do something never before seen on this channel and it's totally not rigged because I have more followers than Jazz Paul and that I probably will get more likes in the end but it's fine because he's at Jazz 95 you guys should all be following him those pictures are right here on the screen right now guys pick which one you want go over and like it whoever gets you put yours over here didn't you yeah, yeah. no I put an eggplant emoji over there that's all oh. right. we'll see you all in the next video always remember the motto of do good die great we love you so much appreciate it merch coming soon I promise <laughs> saying that well, it's true! I haven't even seen it yet. <laughs> well, I haven't even seen it yet. <laughs> <laughs> All right! Bye! Cheers, babe. Did you climax when we ate it together? <laughs> <laughs>